In other news, we can reveal that several employers in Nottingham have now recruited former members of violent street gangs. Some have been given full-time jobs after being mentored at a city boxing gym. It's all part of a programme that's targeting members of notorious local drug gangs. This exclusive report from our social affairs correspondent, Jeremy Ball. A young dad who's earning an honest living, Dean's been working full-time on a building site for the last six months. But it's a chance he never expected because of his criminal record. He served three prison sentences for serious street crimes. Like going to jail, waking up, police kicking off your door, go in town, people want to attack you in town. Like, no, nah, none of that's happened. Nah. Like, I can, I can go down with my kid. All the people that died, man, I would show them not. The knockout blow to Dean's criminal past came when he was invited to this boxing gym where young people from across in the city Nottingham are being helped into training and apprenticeships. But there's also intense one-to-one -one mentoring for those with serious records. It's part of a programme called Switch Up that's targeting hardcore urban street gangs. I've done interview techniques in the ring, we've put a chair in the ring and done interview techniques. We'll help them with life skills, social skills. Dean can call me whenever he wants now. And down the road, this building firm is one of several Nottingham employers who've offered them apprenticeships. And across the city, six former gang members have done so well that they've landed full-time jobs. Getting employers on board like this isn't only building careers. For some, it's a rare second chance to break a cycle of prison and crime. And it's changing lives. I've had a second chance myself. Um, they're looking to break almost the shackles of of that criminal record and, and, and so much grow up and maybe that gets them out of uh, the gang culture that they, they perhaps find themselves in. And for Dean, there are no regrets about going straight. Now he's making plans for a future that he couldn't have imagined. Jeremy Ball, BBC Smithlands Today, Nottingham.